Hi right, everybody, well here we go again lads, so Capo 2 and um, just a, an old, an old last of fast car there, uh, keep it dead simple anyway, second string, that's your starting point, open second, no finger, so there you go and then I'm using pointy finger on second string, first fret, so open second, First fret, second, and then off, open second again. So, open on and off. Try that a few times. Open, first fret, open, open, first fret, open. No. When you get the hang of that, then you go to the the third fret on the second string. Now remember though, I'm going from the capo, so you can play without capo, but it is a lot easier the further up you go. So just keep in mind, I'm just two frets up from the capo there now. So I'm on the third fret now on the second string. Two beats there. So this is very, 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 very simple to watch. Now I'll go again for the top, open, second string now. It's all on the second string uh, this far. First fret, and open second string. Now third fret, second string. Ding, ding. Two beats there, right from the top. La, la. Can you see that? And again for the top, open. I'm just using my thumb for a while just to get the tune. I'm going to try and use the top of the finger maybe. Keep the nails fairly short. Throw from the top again now. Open. First fret. Open. Third fret twice. Now the last bit then, the last section. Nice and handy. Skip over to the third fret bottom string. Play it once. And then go down to the second fret on the very bottom string. And that's it. That's the, the melody, the main part of the melody there. I'll go through it again now. Ready? One, two, three, go. Jump back, bottom string, third fret. Three, two, that's it. And keep repeating that section over and over again. Open one, open ter third fret. Back to the bottom string. Third fret once, second fret once. And then put it all together with a bit of practice. Just play it any way you want until it all kind of connects together. It wouldn't be that hard to get those. Okay, so with the chords, then if you just want to play the chords, then it would be like C major seven or C without the first finger. La 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 la. That's C to G. That's all it is. C minor D there at the end, so it's C major seven is a C with only two fingers. So I'm using three and two. So I'll make your C and just take off the pointy finger. That's there's no baby finger included there, no. So the tune would fit in there with a bit of practice if you went like one, two, three, four. La 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 la. there's much rhythm to it like it wouldn't be like da, 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 you know it's just very very laid back but what I'm doing there is I'm just doing a strum and a tap and then I'm changing to G then I'm going to E minor strum, and then D just straight across there so C G E minor between the strums, I'm just tapping some part of the body of the, of the guitar, that's all. So let's go from the very top, right? Now, later on, if you've got a bit of time where the old goose is cooking, you could include a bass line. So C is the bass note of the C chord. And it's very simple. 
you're starting to pinch now using thumb and middle finger so you get this kind of thing so what I do know is I'm pinching strings 5 and 2 obviously your thumb is always on the bass strings on one of the top 3 and the other fingers are on the bottom lower 3 strings now I hit a B note there you see on the A string 2nd fret that's all it is and I included my third fret up here. So you're playing the melody that we just practiced, but what you're doing is you're including these bass notes. So I just play the bass notes on their own, right? C, B, E, and then D. So with the chords for B, C. I'm using this instead of the G, you see this note here to give it more kind of now that chord shape there, where we played the second string third fret, I'm using a baby finger now because I need the index to come over here, but you can use one and three. You can use these these two, one and three. So start again now, C with the bass note this time. With the bass. Or. So you're pinching five and two. You play the second string again to give it the carry on the sound. No, get that shape and just jump back down. That's it. That's all you got. That's the whole song. Just remember, I'm using index and baby if it suits you know, right? To get down to the. These two chords are exactly the same. See that? And drop down. Drop down from um, 5 and 2 to 4 and 1. And then finally, finally that. So from the very top. You can play this a lot of different ways, but the way I do it anyway is I go, I pinch. And I play the bass string again. To fill it out, just to fill the sound out a little bit more. Right, jump back down. So it's all built around our melody that we played at the start. What would it sound like with one and three? Oops. Finally, guys, if you're really under pressure and a lot of time to kill in the afternoon, you could slide this fella up here. Sounds very sweet. So that would be now fifth fret. Uh, sorry, fifth string, and you're on the seventh fret from the capo. It's the same shape as the one over here, except we move it up here. Can you see the dot there? There's a seven, and then the next fret is the eighth fret on the second string. So it's again, it's this fella. Moved in and right up here. So there you go, fifth and second string. And then that now is a two stre uh, fret stretch there. Very easy. Fret, fret five, index finger, and fret seven, baby finger on the second string. So if you want to get away from this little fella here, which I think is fine, you can transfer it up here. You might get more of a slide up here. Sometimes you can pinch too like this. I'll explain when I see it the next time. It's, it's very easy to get from that position there, you see. Up there with a bit of practice now, but have to finish off the turkey first. Ooh, sorry. Again. It's that, it's that chord, whoa, it's that chord, right up to seven and eight. What do you think? We wish you a Merry Christmas. <laughs> Talk to you soon, guys. Have fun anyway. And then if you want to just slap and tap, or whatever you want to call it. My old man's got a problem. He lives with a bottle, that's the way it is. He's 
body's too old for working. His body's too young to look like his. My mama went off and left him. She wanted more to life than he could give. Somebody's got to take care of him. So I left school, that's what I did. position. It's very simple. Come on lads, are you ready? Get out those sprouts. Talk to you later guys.